Hi guys! So I have quite a part two of a haul. Like this is supposed to be part two. Um, this can be a whole together. Um, so I'm just gonna start into it and yeah. I'm gonna first start off with books that I bought and the first one I bought or got is for my iPod and I got Divergent and I actually got that using Megan Rosette's um, whatever she has, like, it's like a code or something, and, or a link, and I got, pretty much, I got a free book, and I already canceled the subscription <laughs> to it, because I don't want to pay $18 a month, but yeah, so I got that, and then for Kobo, I got, um, it's loading, I got the first book, The Boy Who Sneaks in, th in my bedroom, or in my bedroom window, or something like that, it's got cut off by Kristen Mosley. I've read part of this book on Wattpad, and then she self-published herself, which is great, um, and it was only two forty three, so I was like, yeah, actually it was three oh seven, and then I promo code, um, if I can still find it, I'll link it below, um, and that was 92 cents off that book, so, and book tax was only two forty three, so I really like that, and then, the other one I got, I'm just like going through my receipts. Um, his Hired Girlfriend, which is the cover that's on there right now. And this is another Wattpad author. author. And the book, it was two, um, 2 46 and then I got $0.74 cents off, and it was only $1.94. So I was really excited about that. And then I got My Blood Approves. And this was a series, and it looked really, really interesting. So I was like, why not try it? It's only $0.71 cents for the book, and that, oh no, one oh two. Or something and then um, 31 cents off and it was only 80 cents for the book so I was like okay let me try this out um, then I got picture perfect by Katherine Clark and that was 451 yeah. and then I got watch me um, and that was one of the more expensive books that was, came out to 11.29, and Laura, no, and then I got, I got one book, because the author who wrote Aces Up, and then I held that before, Tor, no, Taurus Trap is like one of my easy read books that I really like, for like, by the pool, and that was 4.51, and I got that too, so those are all the books I got for my Kobo, and then let me get into the shopping part, and I got, first thing I got from Nail Polish Canada, um, I got my Color Club nail polish in uh, Yum Gum, and I got this because I saved up, but, well no, I didn't save up, but I got my points from Game Coins on my PayPal, and I was like, and they were not doing free shipping, and I was like, why not? So I got this, it's like a pastel bright pink color, I really, really like that. And then I went to the mall that is that way, and I'm surrounded by three malls, one that way, one that way, one that way. And I went to the one there yesterday, and I got this bikini bottom, and it's from, it was from Kenneth Cole, and it was, it was in the Bay, and it was $21.60, um, originally 54 and it's just a black bikini bottom, um, I need a proper top to go with it, but I got that, and I think it might have been 30% off this, I'm not exactly sure. And then I got some samples from them as well. And I got three samples of their Hope in a Jar Skin Moisturizer for all skin types. Um, these are from Philosophy. And then I got three of the Purity Made Simple Facial Washes. Then I went to the mall that way today. And I'm exhausted. Put like eight hours there. And the first place I went to was Target. And I bought a couple things. First thing I bought, which was, it was only a dollar, so I was like, why not? It's a spring holder, and I'm going to put all my ear earrings in one bowl, which I have ready, and then my rings will go in here. It'll all look pretty, and I'll love it. And then I bought, and that was only a dollar, and then for a dollar something, dollar twenty-four maybe, I got a hundred cotton balls. I was going to get 200, but that seemed kind of crazy. Then I picked up this, finally, I got a white t-shirt, and this is from Mossimo. This was $8.00 plain white tee, need one, and this one isn't super sheer, like the other one that I tried in its v-neck, and it has a little pocket, which I really like, so there's that, then I got this skirt, and this is like a skirt, circle, high waist skirt, or skater skirt, whatever you want to call it, and it's like pretty, and it has like buttons, and it has like this, it's like a, um, 
light blue with white and then it has like a scrunchie in the back and that's like Aztec print and I like it and that was $23 and the last thing I got was barely branded from the Maybelline color tattoos which I am so happy about um swatched it there and don't know and I really really like this guy and it's so pretty I think for someone just starting out this is the go-to makeup item that's my thoughts then I went to Sephora. I didn't buy anything. This was my first time in Sephora, and I was just like, they're like, and then the lady there was so nice. She was like, oh, I look. I'm like, no, I'm just here, like, being one of those people that like obsessed over things they seen on the internet, and they actually get to see in real life. She's like, it's okay. And what I did get, I got three spoolies because I could not find these anywhere. Am I that kind of a crazy person? And um, Glam Life Guru showed that if you put hairspray on this and like brush your brows with it, it will like make your brows stay in place and I really wanted that to brush, just brush my gel, brows in general so I got a couple of these and then I got a huge sample of the Benefit um, Stay Flawless 15 hour um, uh, primer and I'm so happy about this I am like right, and I'll show you the, the sample she gave me she, could, she just like got the thing and she cut off a huge chunk of it and that is like seriously so happy about that thank you that that made my day I came with this cute little baby she wrote down benefit on it and she put an exclamation point <laughs> thank you that, that, I'm never gonna make that face again trust me so I really really like that <laughs> and then I went to Lush and the first thing they gave me when I went to Lush that I threw on the floor there is this newspaper like thing and it has like all their accomplishments I'm just like good job Lush and all the products and I want all them and I told the lady there that and she's like I know it's okay you will survive all right and then I actually did get some things though and there's what I got and the first time I went in I picked up the mint julep lip scrub and I love this so much I already used it once it smells delicious. It's just like it's really finely milled scrub and it tastes good and it smells good and it does good and my lips feel so soft right now. I really like that. And then I also got a sample of the Ocean Sea Salt um, salt Scrub. This one smells amazing too. Um, and this is so talked about on YouTube. Um, the most recent person I saw talk about it was Nikki Philpi. She used it on her feet and then BW44 used it on her face and then it's just like this most universal scrub ever so I got a sample of that a nice big sample um and then the second time I went I picked up the no drought dry shampoo because I am sick and tired of dry shampoos ending on me with only one use and this one is like you can't run away your stuff will move forever I just want to open it so I can smell it and I smelled it there and it smells like coca-cola and I really like it oh I don't think this is something I can eat them so thank you Drew for making this and then thank you Katie for making this. Thank you very much. So I'm excited to use this and the lady told me how to use it because she has dark she had dark hair too. And you just pour it like this, all like open it halfway and sprinkle it all over your hair and just like tease it in and it'll work the best for us. And then for the samples I got that time, I got this little pot of the tea tree water. And this is apparently great for acne and I got it. <laughs> and I have to be really careful because I might spill. And then I got a sample of the Sandstone Smell Like a Rockstar and Citrus for Glowing Skin. And it's quite weird if you tell you the truth, but I'm excited to try it and play with it. I think it's a soap, maybe. I don't know if it's soap or a scrub. I have to do a little more research on this guy, but I'm excited to try that out too. Then I ventured off into Forever 21. And they had one swimsuit that I fell in love with, but then I didn't like the top, and then I don't know. So I kind of broke up with that. And they had a great sale, and I don't know why I didn't pick up those jeans. or like these pair of jeans for like seven eighty. dollars I don't know why I didn't get them. I did. I didn't. But the first time I went, I got one ring. And then I went to after lunch. And then I got another couple rings. So I got this first ring, and it has like arrows on it. And you know what this would look great on? On my new ring holder. I don't know. I kind of was on a ring mission. And they'd only had gold rings. They had like one silver ring and those are my size. And then the second time I got 
with this ring, which is like one of the open rings, which I really think is really cool. And it's like has little black studs, and it's so pretty. And that could go in my ring holder too. And then I got this one, which is a giraffe. And I'm like, yeah. And this was 380. These two were 380. The other one was 180. Yeah. This was six something. The this was nine something. Did I forget the prices for anything else? I don't know. But this is my ring, and I'm so cool because I have a giraffe on my ring. You're jealous. Yeah. So that's my ring holder now, and it's looking bossy. And then I went to Old Navy, and I got some stuff from them too. I got, first of all, I got these bright, bright, corally, highlighter pink flip-flops, which I really like. And this was kind of just like an impulse that just has no realness behind it. But these were only $2, and they were having a sale, so I got them. And then I got the same flip-flops in white just because I needed some logicness. And then I got the same flip-flops in black, because once you have white, once you have black, you're pretty much set. So I got that. Then I finally got what I was looking for, which was a swimsuit. And the uh, I'm going to show you the top first. All tankini tops were $15, so I got this. And I was like, okay, coming! It has a retro vibe to it, and I really, really like that. It has purple string, and yeah. And then I have the bottom, and the bottom I want for something with like the tied side because that way it won't be as conservative because the top's really conservative, so I went with this. And it's just purple, and this was $21. So that is my haul, and as you just heard me tell me that, I have to go. See you guys later. Bye.